Radically candid criticism is in person. We say all the time that radical candor or feedback is not measured at the speaker's mouth, but at the listener's ear. And the reason we say that is because what's most important is how the other person is experiencing your feedback. Remember, the purpose of criticism is to help people know what to do better. So of course what matters most is how they're internalizing or hearing your feedback. The other thing you have to bear in mind, of course, is that some huge percentage of communication is nonverbal. So by giving criticism in person, that gives you the best chance of really seeing and feeling exactly how that person is feeling about your feedback. Now, it's not always possible to give feedback in person. So we talk about a hierarchy of mediums to use when you can't do that. First, video conference. At least with video conference, you can still get a sense for body language and, and understand how someone's feeling about your feedback. Next is phone, then email, text. Email and text, not great. Sort of last resort, I would say. Just remember, don't break up over text. One final thought. We recently did a tip saying that radically candid criticism is immediate. It is very common that there's a natural trade-off between immediacy and in-person, especially if you're in, say, a global organization. We say go for immediacy over in-person. Just remember the hierarchy of medium. Prioritize video conference, for example, over all others, and you should be good to go.